Hey there YouTubes, now if you watched my other video about Pro B9 and Pro B10, this is a new update patch which allows you to play Call of Duty Modern Warfare, okay? Now, basically you need to download two patch files for this, okay? Uh, I'll explain to you in a minute what ones you need. Um, so basically, you need to, oh, I've got no fucking volume have I, sorry hold on, let's put the volume up. Right, basically you need to download these patches which work in conjunction with the Pro B9 and B10. Now my video, if you look at that video, I'd explain to you what systems will um, will work with that particular software and also um, how to install it. Now basically this reads Xbox games in a RAW file format which allows you to shrink the image which is allowed which allows you to put it on a smaller memory card. Now I'm using an 8 gig. Um, this particular file is about 3.5 gigs um, compressed, so it's quite a large file and it does take quite a long time to um, to do it as well, okay? Um, also, the other patch you're going to need is uh, the Xbox Live patch. This patch allows you to log into your Xbox Live account via Wi-Fi, so you must make sure that your PSP is Wi-Fi enabled. Okay, so as long as we've got that straight. Now what I'm going to show you is uh, the PSP running the game. It runs quite smoothly. Uh, there's not much lag and there's, there's not much of anything really. So that's what you've got to look forward to, alright? So um, once you've installed it onto the memory card, you need to make sure you're online. You need to make sure that you're signed in using the Xbox Live patch. And then go to multiplayer. It does take a little while to uh, load because it's running off the memory card and not the disk. So once you uh, logged in, it should come up. Please work. I've had a couple of issues with it where it crashed, but I think I've managed to resolve that. But like I say, you do need these patches for it to work properly. Right, so we're into multiplayer. And we're going to go, I don't know if you can see that. Multiplayer, find match. And we're just waiting for it to load. Please wait. Oh no, my camera's a bit shocking really. Getting match data or whatever it does. does take time because like I say it's run off the PSP. Don't forget it's going to be Xbox button configuration so your A is going to be X on your PSP, your B is going to be your O on the PSP, your square is going to be your X and your triangle is going to be your Y. So as long as you know that it's pretty easy to, um, to play. Now we're going to play Hardcore Team Deathmatch and we're just going to wait for this to load up. So remember there's your buttons there, okay? So remember X, A, O is B, square is X, and triangle is Y. Okay, now the only problem you have got is, obviously, your grenades and your aiming. So aim is that one, shoot is that one. But with this one, what he's managed to do is, um, grenades... Um, grenades, laying claymores and other things are done with the D-pad instead. Okay. So remember it's the 360 RA patch which you need to install with your Pro B9 B10. And also you need to install the Xbox Live patch as well. So watch my other video shows you how to put Pro B9 B10 on and play your backed up images from your UMD and what I'll do with this one I will um, put some links in the video description to send you to the correct site where you need to download these patches okay so we're just waiting for it to load now I'll put the link yeah I'll put the links in for you guys also, don't forget my other videos as well is my Nintendo DS R4 card, which allows you to play 
um, movies, music, and also your backed up NDS games, which you must own from original, as I cannot promote piracy. I also own Modern Warfare 3, if anyone wants to know. There's my copy there. So, while we're loading up, 